I'm Dan. And I'm Dudley. Welcome to the show. Welcome to the show. How are you doing? I'm sleepy. Yeah? I just woke up from a it's, nap. It's like two o'clock. I just had a nap. <laughs> it's nap o'clock, Daniel. Yeah, I, I, you nap a lot. No, you... Yes. You... You interrupted my nap. I I did not. You I got did. up and said, are you ready to do the show? Yeah, well, you know. I'm ready to do the show. You ready to do the show? No, you were like, we have to do it early today. And I'm like, yes. okay. And I went and took a nap. Yeah. yeah it's not that early. But earlier mm-hmm. than earlier. usual. Earlier. Um, mm-hmm. You know, trying to kind of keep... Get, you know, we don't need to do it late all the time. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But you mm-hmm. nap too much. That's the problem. That's not the problem that at is all. That's never I don't nap at all. It never. I'm not much well, of a napper. No, nope. Not. I work. I get up, and I go about my day. I fill, fill up a whole day, and yeah. then I go to bed at a reasonable hour. Yeah. I yeah. sleep a, real, a normal amount of time, mm-hmm. and then that's all I need. No. I don't need to take a nap in the middle of the day. Uh, no, that's that's inefficient use of time. You're dumb. I also feel <laughs> terrible after I take a nap. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I like naps. Yeah, yeah, you do. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but I don't. I don't like waking up. I feel groggy. Mm-hmm. I feel terrible. I don't like it. I don't like it. Not a napper. I am a a anti napper. Mm-hmm. You're you you pro nap. Mm-hmm. Yep. And I, I like nap. I mean that in the sense that you are a you are in favor of napping, not that you're a professional napper. Mm-hmm. Uh, are you done? <laughs> I mean, though I guess you could qualify. <laughs> you could qualify in a in a napping contest. <laughs> You wouldn't place, but you could qualify. <laughs> uh, I wouldn't have the uh, endurance <laughs> <laughs> to place. Uh-huh. I would. Uh, I would. Uh, <laughs> I tap out. <laughs> you tap out. <laughs> like I'm um, just. I can't. I can't, I can't nap it. anymore. I can't, I'm done. I've mm-hmm. napped as much as possible. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I didn't reach the. Mm-hmm. You're not an endurance napper. You're mm-hmm. you're a sprinter. Um, you're a s- nap sprinter. Uh, I'm a cat napper. <laughs> you're a cat napper. Uh. Uh-uh. Yeah. Yeah. All right. You done with your yeah, I've, whatever I've, I've played that one out. It's done. Okay. Good. Yeah. Moving on. Yeah. Um, you play some games? I played a bunch of games this I, week. I, that's good, because I only played, like, one. Yeah. What, Star Wars Destiny? No, I haven't even done that. Didn't you play with... What was that last week? I thought you and you and the lady friend played a match, but maybe not. Um, n- Not not this week. Oh, okay. Well, I haven't I'm played one confused. this week. Y'all have been playing a lot. Yeah, we played a lot. Mm-hmm. And uh, now she she's ready. She told me she wants a new deck, so I'm mm-hmm. like, okay. Mm-hmm. So she's ready for something she's fresh. been wanting to play, but we I, she wants a new deck, and I haven't had time to really sit down uh-huh. and make her a new deck because mm-hmm. it's a little more complicated than normal. Because I have to make sure I don't have the there's cards no overlap the, overlapping. Yeah, yeah. Because it's all my cards. So I card. gotta I gotta you know. You need Make to tell sure. her. You need to tell her to get her own cards. <laughs> no, 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 no. I need her to keep buying me cards. <laughs> oh, oh, I see. I see. That's, That's why I, I allowed this. Uh huh. <laughs> um, but mm-hmm. she wants to play again. Mm-hmm. And uh, but uh, what happens uh, if you? Uh, that means you got to double up your your set, though. So you can, yeah, you can have two of the same okay. thing. If she keeps no yawning, into it, no, don't do that. If she keeps getting into it like this, mm-hmm. we may have to start uh-huh. giving her our own set. Um, mm-hmm. But I I don't know. I'll, I'll figure it out. Um, <laughs> You'll probably be. I'll probably keep half the cards that are in her current deck, and mm-hmm. then you know, just see. What got. But she hasn't told me what characters she wants to play. Mm-hmm. So yeah, that 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 will shape everything. Yeah, I need to have something to work from, and and mm-hmm. I haven't got it pinned down on that yet. Mm-hmm. And uh, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, I made a. Pro- I have played a lot <laughs> of new games. Um, yeah. I have purchased some games. Some games I've been talking about playing and I haven't played yet. Mm-hmm. Uh, in the VR realm. Mm-hmm. I, uh, the virtual realm. Mm-hmm. Uh, virtual reality. Yeah, virtual realm. Reality. Uh, it's called virtual realm. It's v- VR virtual realm. Reality. It's realm. Real- Realm's real- a better word. Reality. Uh, the mm-hmm. uh, Space Pirate Trainer. Whoops, uh, I dropped that. Yeah. Uh, is... One of the ones I purchased, mm-hmm. it is fantastic. Yeah. It is really fun. Yeah. It's basically a little arcade game. Um, like, you, you're set up on, a, like, a spaceport platform, mm-hmm. and they're throwing waves of robots at you that exponentially get tougher and tougher. Okay. And, and you have options of weapons. You have you have two. You can either have a pistol, mm-hmm. one in each hand, uh, that has, like, six modes. So you have, like, single fire, multi-fire, uh, 
like a rapid auto, semi-auto type or automatic type fire, and mm-hmm. then you have um, a beam weapon, a shotgun blast type thing, short range mm-hmm. shotgun, uh, and a grenade launcher. I think that's all of them. That was yeah. all six. I don't know. I didn't. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, and so y- each pistol you can switch between those modes, which I like them. They're all really cool. I find myself switching between them. Mm-hmm. Uh, and then, but you can also do this like behind the over the shoulder draw weapon motion mm-hmm. and switch it out for like a baton looking thing yeah. that has two modes. One of them is shield, which I use a lot, and it bounces beams back. And uh, I find myself playing with a shield and a single pistol, and that's how I play a lot. Yeah. But you can also use the, the baton in, like, a power mode where you can, like, reach out and grab robots and sling them around. Huh. Okay. And then also there's, like, two devices, at least two that I've noticed, that you can, like, hit them with the electrical beam thing and it'll charge them up and they'll attack things. Hmm. One of them shoots a huge beam laser, but I haven't really gotten aiming it down. You have to, like, aim it a weird way mm. and it's I haven't got aim I'm not very good at aiming it yet <laughs> and it had some kind of cooldown so I couldn't you can't just keep using it uh, yeah. but for the most part I play with like you can do two dual wielding cute mm. stuff which is fun but I find I'm not very accurate with it as mm. you would be with two weapons mm-hmm. uh, uh, but um, you're I not you're not like John McCain M- John McCain John John McClain. Yeah. I kept saying John McCain. Yeah, John That's, McCain is a different person. Yeah, he, he, he is a real person. He can't do it. He, he might. He was in the military. He was a POW. Uh, I mean... I mean, he might have... He might be... He might... I could see... You know, I know he's older now, but, you know, yeah, maybe in his heyday, he could just, think. like... You know... Anyway, John McClain. McClain. You can't John McClain it and just be like... Bah, 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 jumping through the air and, I like... I remember him sh- doing sh- that. Sh- no, he probably didn't. I, I remember him crawling he had more of an a air duct. Talking about machine gun dinners. thing, <laughs> yeah, and 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 the yippee ki yay type, you know, thing. Y- yippee ki yay, motherfucker. Yeah, you go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Say the whole thing if you're gonna commit. I'm committed. Uh, uh, I don't really remember him as a dual wielding type guy. Yeah, so much. Yeah, I I mostly think of Max Payne, mm-hmm. <laughs> and mm. that's, that's the first thing that pops in my head when I think of. Dual I think wielding. of like. Shaun of the Dead, or uh, not Shaun of the Dead, uh, Hot Fuzz. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you, yeah. 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 They're, they do the jump through the air with yeah. two guns. Yeah, yeah. Mostly making fun of, like, John Woo movies. Yeah. <laughs> and, so, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, that kind of thing. Yeah. Um, the, huh. I have completely, but anyway, I find myself using one gun and a shield, because mm-hmm. the shield is super useful, because one, you can chew a pulse, and it makes, like, a little warp thing where it scatters beams, mm-hmm. like laser beams. Uh, and then it also you can just block stuff with it and it bounces back. Yeah. And then I but I mostly use it and just shoot for mount because I'm terrible at dodging. But yeah. I played it I played it for a couple of hours now and it, I've worn myself out. <laughs> like good dump, workout. Yeah, it's a pretty good, good workout because I'm like dropping, I'm ducking and moving and running, j- jumping to the side and like moving all over the place, shooting at yeah. thing. Yeah, got and some it, cardio. Yeah, in. yeah. <laughs> and it and it plays very much like an arcade like. You know, where you have, like, little power-ups that pop up every once in a while when you kill a, a, a bad guy. Mm-hmm. And you can shoot it and get that ability. And it's just one wave after another. It's got hmm. a scoreboard. Uh, you'll have to come play it. It's, it's yeah. hugely fun. Mm-hmm. It's a I'll lot of fun. Try. I you, enjoy it quite You have several little VR games I haven't played yet, and yeah. I need to. So, uh, which, yeah. Speaking of which, my, my girlfriend wants to play a VR game. Yeah, okay. Um, which, she, which one do, should we introduce her to? I don't know, because she was like, she played one before, mm-hmm. and she liked it, and she was like, D- she, I don't, she didn't even know you had, we had one. Yeah. She was just like, do you have one of those, like, headset uh-huh. game things? I was like, Daniel does. She mm-hmm. goes, I want to play it. Uh-huh. <laughs> I'm like, okay. <laughs> so, um, at some point, I may so we'll, have to, we'll have to get her set I got it all up. set up right now. It's ready yeah. to rock and roll. Um, mm. I, I need to introduce my lady friend to it too, mm. just to see how she likes it. Yeah. But, uh, it's uh, so much fun. But the other one is Iron Wolf VR, mm-hmm. which is really cool, and it, on a like an intellectual level, it's like slower paced. Mm-hmm. It's like you know, because you're manning, you're basically a one man crew of a of a submarine. Yeah, and you basically, I went through the training and I did the first mission or two. And you're just, like, going, you dive it, and you're moving it around, you're navigating it, mm-hmm. and, like, you do the whole periscope thing and, and locking on a target, and, and once you're lock, target locked, you can fire torpedoes, mm-hmm. and, and you can actually guide the torpedoes, I think. Hmm. Uh, but you're monitoring, like, your oxygen levels and diesel levels and all this other stuff. Uh, but it's, I haven't got that far into it, cause, so it hadn't got too complicated, but I can see how it could it yeah. can, you're, you're get more complex. Yeah. 
But you can also like surface, and you got like a surface um, a like a machine gun and a cannon that you can shoot at stuff, and you can shoot at airplanes. I haven't used it yet, but um, oh, man, it's cool. Mm-hmm. It's really cool. I think it has a multiplayer element where oh, you can really? play against other, I guess, other Another submarine. submarine. I'm not really sure yet, but mm-hmm. it'd be pretty good to have like a, a someone on a, I don't know, like a destroyer, you know, who's seeking out like a submarine. I don't know. Destroy. I, I'm not sure if you play against each other trying to destroy each other's submarine or if you're trying to, like, you're both trying to take out a target. Maybe yeah. I'm not really sure how it plays, but. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's cool. You should find that out. I should. I, I, I'll I play it some more and, and yeah. get it go. Um, I, I like it a lot. It's yeah. like, it's a slower pace game. Mm-hmm. It's like, you're just kind of, you know, you're, you, it's, it's pretty accurate. You like, gotta put, you gotta let in water to sink mm-hmm. and then you gotta push, use air, you know, pull in like uncompressed air to, to lift back up and, yeah. and it's, it's pretty cool. Mm-hmm. And the buoyancy, yeah, and buoyancy that. and all that stuff, mm. and uh, it's cool. Mm. It's really cool. Mm. I, I like it. I need to play it some more. I yeah. also played a little bit of Fallout Four VR. Oh yeah, I haven't played it in a while, and I was like, since I had it up and running, I I played it some more. It didn't bother me as much as it did the first few times. Mm-hmm. Like I, you know, I, I got a little heady. Yeah, uh, but it, I actually played for uh, about an hour or so. Didn't I was getting tired more? I get physically tired mm-hmm. playing some VR yeah. room scale well, yeah. games. Is like exercise. <laughs> it, well, yeah. <laughs> because I'm standing and mm-hmm. I get tired. Mm-hmm. That's really, more often than not, I stop playing VR games because I'm physically tired of standing mm-hmm. rather than oh, like, I'm, I'm, I'm ready playing. to stop playing yeah. this game. Because you're, you're out of shape. That's mm-hmm. the problem. What are you doing? Put your phone away. No, I'm just stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. You're ruining our show. Uh, I am not. <laughs> yes, you um, are. Uh, <laughs> the... Uh, yeah, it, it's such a cool game, but again, it's it's overwhelming because mm-hmm. I think it's a combination of two things. Why I haven't like dove into it? One, it's overwhelming the scale of that game. Yeah, and it's you know such a big game, and the fact that I played it already. I've got a hundred hours in it, I think, and so mm-hmm. I have played a lot of it already. So I'm just kind of wandering around, just getting into combat situations, just to play around. Yeah. So I haven't like felt the need to dive into the Fallout story so mm-hmm. much as just wander Already around the world stuff. Yeah, but it's intimidating. Yeah, it's like you walk into a room and then just like a flood of of ghouls come running at you. I'm just like, ah! and I just unload all my ammo really quickly. Yeah, I'm just like, ah! and I just start shooting. And yeah, then, and then I'm like taking, like aiming and doing good shots. And, yeah, uh, stop! Put your phone away. I'm not doing You're anything. Just, just stop it. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, mm-hmm. so it's been oh, it's fun. Mm-hmm. The VR stuff is really fun. Like I said, it's like, physically exhausting. Yeah. Uh yeah. But nice. I'm, I'm enjoying all of them. They're really yeah. cool. Um, I've only played one thing. Oh, yeah? What it was a board game. Yes. The, a new board game. Yes. That the uh, the Cartwrights. Yes. Our, our, Trey. Our, our Trey. family friends, the Cartwrights. Yeah, Trey. Uh, Trey Cartwright. Uh, the third Trey man. and Brandy. And uh, they uh, they had a new game mm-hmm. called Downforce. Yes. And it's a racing board game. Yes. And it's apparently a remake. It's a, it's a remake from a company that does re- recreations of old board games. Mm-hmm. And this is they one of their... I can't remember what the original was called. There were apparently like several versions of it. One yeah. of them was like F1 Racing or something like yeah. that. And uh, there was a couple other names. I can't remember yeah. them. But, but uh, yeah. it's really fun. It's hugely fun. I it, liked it a lot. It's a very interesting uh, dynamic. And yes. It's not like you get a car and you race it. It's mm-hmm. more... Uh, well, you bid for cars, yeah. So you, you can you have, have to own at least one. one car, yeah. But you can't own, own multiple cars, yeah. So like the first game we played, uh, you and Trey mm-hmm. had each own two two cars, and I had one, and Brandy had one. Mm-hmm. So there's six cars, mm-hmm. cars, and uh, you play cards down. Yeah, you to, start with uh, a hand of car colored cards. Yeah, and they have a list of colors and numbers on mm-hmm. them. Um and you know, different cards have different ones mm-hmm. and you play that down, you m- the cars move based on what the colors are on the deal. So you don't move just your cards. Mm-hmm. You move multiple cards. Yeah, whatever cards are on the on card. the card. Yeah. Cars on the card. Yeah. Yes. Cart. Hey, cart. Can you hear the distinction of cars and card? <laughs> um, no, but anyway. You're not confusing this at all. Not at all. Uh, um, but so basically, each card has like a list of colors and a number associated, and that's mm-hmm. how many spaces that 
color color car moves. moves. And so when you play it, you have to move them all as far as they can move. Yeah. But you can bottleneck stuff where you can't get. Yeah, and the track is little spaces, and sometimes there's three wide spaces, sometimes there's two, and sometimes Mm -hmm. there's just one. So they can bottleneck in, and you can only move in from one square that's connected to another square. And uh, but there's also little powers Mm -hmm. you get. Each person has that they can use to you know give themselves a little edge. Mm -hmm. Um, And it's a lot of fun. So the whole thing is you're racing around the track. So you have your car and you're trying to get first. Well, yeah. you, and there's prizes for getting first, second, third, fourth, mm-hmm. um, and then there's also betting. Mm-hmm. So you're betting on who's going to win, which mm-hmm. you don't have to necessarily pick your car. Yeah, you can pick um, the cards that actually might you know, you actually think. There's three stages of mm-hmm. that. So each stage you pick. Yeah, uh, as you get closer to the end, you you, you're, you, you see you have a better idea of who you think might win. Yeah, and the ma- what, not the amount of money you can win at each stage goes down, but you yeah, know. if you get the first place so, and it's first, second, third on that, and you get prizes for that. Yeah, so you could you can kind of uh, balance it by mm-hmm. you know getting money for even if you don't win the race. Yeah. And uh, the first game we played was pretty good. Yeah, uh, pretty good. Yeah, the uh, there there because because at the beginning of the game you you're buying cars mm-hmm. and you have to bid. Based on the numbers on your card, you can bid up to like six uh, m- million dollars or whatever yeah. it is, six monies mm-hmm. on uh, buying cards. Mm-hmm. And once you and then so you, that's your your kind of starting negative is yeah. you can buy multiple cars, but, you, but you're, you're costing you more. It, that's that that's going to co- go against you in the points at the end. And mm-hmm. then at the end, you total how much how much money you won from placing where your car is placed. And how much you how want much from money, betting. Yeah, and how much you want from betting, and then you subtract how much you spent, and that's your final yeah. score. So if you have more cars, you're more likely to place more but because you're, you're if spending you're, more. You're, but you're spending more, mm-hmm. and so you kind of, you know, get negates it a yeah. little bit. But uh, it, 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 the first game went really well for yeah. me. Yes, it did. You uh, you came out ahead on the first race. I, I won first place. Yes. I also put all on me. Mm-hmm. So I ended up with mm. a ton of money. Yeah, you came from like behind almost because I was winning the whole. Yeah, like my you car, were one space. One, from winning. My, yeah, my car was ahead like the whole race, mm-hmm. and I got one sp- like right at the finish line, one space. I needed someone to move me one, mm-hmm. and I would have won. Yeah, and then you came and zipped right past and and yep. got first. And I, I had a, second place. a card that got six, and I just went whoop, right yeah. past you, and yeah. I won, and yeah. it was glorious. And then. On the second game, mm-hmm. we we just rolled it over into the next race, just kind of winner takes all type thing. Yeah, and I started off terribly because we were doing the more complex. Yeah, you were race complaining track. a lot. Yeah, well, uh, I I zoomed up and then someone got in front of me and I could not move. I only had one car this time. Yeah, and I could not move yeah. for like two rounds of like everyone playing. I did not move, so mm-hmm. I was all the way at the back. Yeah, but I managed to just like through some some clever tricks and because there is a system of like yeah the top card can usually the top card on race car on the card is moves the furthest mm-hmm. it moves like six spaces but you can finagle it where there's something in front of them so they, so can't, they can't go move. Yeah. so you can negate you can play a card that give technically could give an enemy six moves but because they have blocked they can't it doesn't they don't get yeah. to use it it's, which there's is awesome. a real strategy to there's it there's a lot of um, cool little strategy to it the second game i like went a little wild with yeah. the bidding and i ended up with three cars yes you did cars and so i did uh, not i ended up with one that i well paid yeah because i had all the extra ones. i paid the minimum everyone had one and i had three yeah <laughs> um I, uh and it and was a. Uh, it, it was it, good. It worked out I, okay I, for me. I won. I won first place. My car zoomed in right at the end. Like yeah. it was you and uh, Trey were fighting the whole way, whole yeah. race, and I was way at the back. But uh-huh. I managed to get my guy up there, and then right at the end, like yeah. I think Trey was right up against the finish line. You were back, not far from it. Yeah. And I just bam went right past both of you and won. Yeah, and, and then that put me in place to get second. Yes. So I was able to get second with one of my cars. Yeah. And then like third or yeah. third or fourth with my another one, and then mm. and then nothing with my last one. Yeah, and it's funny because I didn't bet on myself at all. Yeah, I bet it on you and Trey winning first or second or something because mm-hmm. I was so far behind it for most of the game. I was like, "There's no way I'm gonna win." Mm-hmm. And then, but so I still played second and third. Yeah, so, so I still, still made some, money off. Yeah, it. I bet it all on me again, yeah. <laughs> all on green. Uh-huh. Um, and then. Because Both of that, games. and because I didn't spend hardly any money on that one car, yeah, 
I ended up winning. Mm-hmm. Like, I ended up with the most money at the end of it. It was actually yeah. pretty... I was really surprised. Yeah. But yeah. it's cool because of how it... Like, that game's really fantastic because even if you start off early, like, not doing well, it can turn <sighs> Well, yeah, because really it starts easily. out with not a lot of people are giving you mm-hmm. moves or they're doing moves that mm-hmm. don't help you to all of a sudden... You yeah. Know, all There's a balance of their... Yeah, everyone has the same uh, grand Course. total of moves. It's just how they get played and whether you get to use them all. And yeah. Like, if you're not getting a lot of moves early on, they're going to come up eventually because there are cards with your color on it somewhere. Yeah. Well, and I actually, my, my last card didn't finish because I didn't have the card to exactly. finish it out. Yeah. So mm-hmm. I was like, well, I played all the cards with his color on mm-hmm. it. I'm done. Yeah. <laughs> um, and no one else was playing because they'd all finished the race already because mm-hmm. you don't play any cards if you finish, if yeah. you're, you don't have any cards still racing. Yeah. And it's, uh, it's, it's a really cool game. It's fun. I really like I want to play it some more. Yeah, it was very, uh, very fun. We played so, yeah. two rounds of it, and uh, it was it's yeah. very so good. So if you but like if you like a racing game, yeah. board and game. And it's got a, it's got, got two some good two strategy. tracks. Yeah, it comes with two tracks, and you can get expansions. That yeah, there's more. apparently DLCs with more that are just more tracks. You say DLC, D- yeah. downloadable content. Yeah, you know, <laughs> it's uh, expansions. Uh, uh, I just <laughs> it would be what would be the uh, uh, replacement for the D? Um, uh, the uh, buyable. Uh, at store content, TLC purchasable, purchasable. Wait, D- L and download DL is downloadable. Yeah, which I don't understand because that's one word. Mm-hmm. See, now I just I'm bringing now that it down. Be it, DC. Make it, it should be DC. Downloadable is one D- word. Da- DC, yeah, yeah. Your downloadable content. Yeah. That's, um, that's, so this that's would wrong. be uh, store purchasable content. Yeah. S P C. <laughs> That's a weird uh, yeah. lettering. SPC. But the expansions, mm-hmm. the expansions uh, add multiple, add extra tracks, yeah. which are really cool. I think that could it really changes up the game. Oh yeah, and you can kind of do like a Grand Prix mm-hmm. where you're, uh, or or Grand Prix, as mm-hmm. we like to call it, mm-hmm. um, and uh, you know do multiple races and see mm-hmm. who comes out on top. Yeah. Uh, I really like it. If it's you, a fun if, game. If, if, I highly recommend anybody check it out. And uh, yeah, um, and it'll play six it players. It'll play six. Yeah, two to six, and it doesn't really change much as far as I know about the number of players. You just have more or less cars. Yeah, you can, and and you can have unowned cars. There yeah, are, they, they they still stay in the race. There's always six cars yeah, in the you race. Just don't uh, you, you just, just don't you, have, have, you may not be t- pushing yeah. for them to do it. Yeah, exactly. they're just they're just. A little, There's uh, stuff you, know, you can p- get in the way. NPCs for you to abuse. Yeah, and <laughs> put in the way of your enemies. Mm-hmm. But uh, it's really good. I yeah. really liked it. He had Trey had got it a, a month or so ago, and he had texted, showed us up pictures of it. Yeah. And I was like, ever since he told us about it, I was like, I really want to play this, and I kind of forgot about it. Yeah. So this weekend, he was just like, yeah. hey. You know, y- y- I, was, I was over there, and I was, he was like, I don't have this game. And I was like, well, let me text Daniel, see yeah. what he's doing. Yeah. We'll yeah. may play, and we yeah. did. Mm-hmm. Um, and it was good. It, it was, was great. It was good. And then we saw Infinity Wars a second time, mm-hmm. which is also great. Which is also good. I think it's safe to say that everybody, based on the numbers, everybody has seen yeah, Infinity If you're Wars. listening to the show and you have not seen it, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> go watch it. Like, go give them it's your really money. You're, you're, I guess if you don't like Everyone Marvel else movies. is jumping off the cliff. You should follow them. <laughs> <laughs> I the, guess if you don't like Infinity Marvel The Infinity Wars... Uh, lemmings are all we're all going off the cliff with yeah. this. Let's I go. <laughs> I guess if you don't like Marvel movies, yeah, but those people are dumb. Not necessarily. No, they, they just they just don't, don't understand. Care. You know, they just uh, don't care for it. The joy of entertainment. Maybe they just don't like mindless superhero com. Well, uh, they just don't movies. understand it. Don't understand. No, that's not. That's they not are, fair. They are not that's human not beings. Fair. They don't have hearts. That's not fair. I don't think that's fair at all. You you can you can think whatever you want. Uh huh. Uh huh. <laughs> Uh, uh, <laughs> you but gotta, they can't. <laughs> well, I'm just saying mm-hmm. they should follow the the rest of us. <laughs> Some of us have done it twice. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, you should. Uh, you should catch up. It's, uh-huh. all, it's been out a week. What it's are you doing out, with your it's life? It's been out a whole week. <laughs> uh, mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Um, you have a Nintendo thing. I did. Uh, mm-hmm. What two weeks ago? Nintendo Labo came out, mm-hmm. and you. And uh, I. Made a we were in the. Uh, a Best Buy, and they rose. They were sitting there staring at us, saying, "Buy me, yes, buy me, yes." I so I bought the variety pack. Mm-hmm. Uh, you, I tried to convince you to get the robot pack. Yeah, and I might eventually. Yeah, but, but I couldn't get you. To do yeah, it. I'm, on, I'm maybe. Uh-huh. I like it, but yeah. I. Just, 
money. <laughs> yeah, so I've been playing around with Nintendo a lot, but the big surprise for me uh-huh. is how long it takes to put these things together. <laughs> yeah. It, took, yeah, it, it takes, takes a, a while. while. The first one was time. like quick and easy, like less than 30 minutes, mm-hmm. like a little RC robot r- control, remote control robot thing. Yeah. Uh, which, which is pretty cool. It's kind of cool. It's really fun. Uh, and then the other, I the next one was the uh, fishing one. Mm-hmm. It's a little, uh, yeah. it's a little box where you you put your, uh, your switch in, switch in and the and screen the is, and then you have a little fishing rod, fishing rod that has a little crankable wheel and a string that goes behind the screen that like mat- when you pull it one way or the other, it matches up with the, the mm-hmm. screen. It's really clever. Yeah. And there's this cool little clever little pulley system. That uses rubber band so that you can pull up on it and then it just it just reels the string back in. Yeah, and it's oh, it's really clever. It's really simple, but it's oh, it's it's, oh, it's amazingly clever. Mm-hmm. And part of the reason I that part of the reason I finally broke down and went ahead and bought it was the fishing game because yeah. I knew my parents would get a kick out of it. Our parents, yes. Our parents, yes. They spawned. This I mean, place. I like to think of them as mine, but okay. Yeah. Um, well, they're both of ours. Yeah, sure. Okay. Mm-hmm. Fine. Yeah, yeah, that's that's I mean technically true. Yes, but they're <laughs> um, mm-hmm. the and they both got a huge kick out of it. Yeah, they both like I think mom spent one evening just over there playing. Spent, and yeah, she was just standing at the table. Yeah, playing. standing at the table, fishing, fishing, <laughs> fishing, fishing. Um, first I'm time. not very good at it. No, I've tried it. It's I'm terrible. It's, it's at got, it. it takes a, like the basic stuff is not hard, but when you start trying to catch bigger stuff, it gets tricky. Yeah. Well, um, it, it, I haven't done very well mm-hmm. catching anything. And <laughs> I, I get too, I guess, aggressive with too it. Too aggressive, you're like jerking on it real hard. And it, it just, uh, excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> what? You gotta, you gotta be what less are we aggressive. About now? It. Don't jerk on it so hard. Um, you're well, that's hurt not the problem. It's you're going to hurt yourself, Dudley. It just gets hung up on other things, <laughs> and, you know, it breaks off, and uh, that's unpleasant. Ow. Ow. Unpleasant. That sounds really unpleasant. It, it's um, not, and the fish gets away. Yes, yes. Mm-hmm. Um, and I, the second one, I, the third one I made is the house one, where mm-hmm. you have, like, a little pet inside yeah, of it. Yeah, a little football and, thing. Yeah, it's a house. It it's got, like, two, three slats on the side of it, mm-hmm. and you can you have different little... Uh, interfaces that that plug into them, mm-hmm. so you have like a button that presses on it, and then you have a a, a, a lever that's like spring loaded with a rubber band mm-hmm. that that you know release that you can turn and it yeah. snaps back, and then you have a cranking like another crank wheel kind of mm-hmm. like on the fishing rod, and each one does something different depending on where you plug it into the house. Yeah, and I'm certain there's more to it, and like all of these things, it, I've seen videos of more of it. Than like than what I've done with them, yeah. And I'm like, there's more to this. I just haven't figured out how to get that far. Yeah. And there's a whole other section in the game called Discover that goes into more depth on some of the stuff. Yeah. I and haven't probably... actually played with it in that much, but um, I'm gonna explore it some more soon. Um, I have one complaint about the game. What's that? Um, see, you bought it and you built the stuff, yes. which is fine. Yes. I don't own it, so I didn't build the stuff. Yes. Well, when you first play it. Mm-hmm. It makes you go through at yeah. least one of these constructions. Yeah, because you took the game and cartridge ju- and put it in your your console my switch, and yeah. treated it like a new play. Yeah, and so I could you know mess around with yeah. it. Well, it made me go through the entire yeah f- construction. At least the first one. I think uh, once you didn't do one, it I had I did one. I went through the fishing one, and yeah. I was just sitting there going scrolling through. I guess I should have did this first one with smaller. Yeah, I, I probably I, well, been. we didn't know that because you were wanting to try out the fishing one, and yeah. so you went through the fishing one. Yeah, and but I think you could have just fast forwarded through the probably the small one, and then it would have let me just jump to because it, yeah. it, it didn't unlock the yeah. play section until you've done at least one big, yeah. which was fine, but it took a while to. Sc- Quickly get through it. Yeah, even fast forwarding it, you had to. Get, it took a while. Yeah, it took a good yeah. five minutes, five yeah. ten minutes, yeah. and I was like, that was a little frustrating. Also, I clicked on the discovery part mm. at one point, and there was like this whole dialogue thing. Yes. Yeah. Took for there was no way to skip it. Yeah, or and back that was, out of it. Back or, out of it. Yeah, and I was like, oh, that's annoying. Yeah, there's some weird like I think there's some that they're bound to update it at some point. Cause I'm sure other people are complaining about yeah, it. Yeah, like, it's a little, they, they just little you weird. Add, you get stuck in stuff, I, and it's like, okay, come on. Let me yeah, skip through I, this. I don't, through all I don't care stuff. about this. I just want to mm-hmm. play the game yeah. or whatever. And yeah, I don't so, like that either. Yeah, so and I get it. If it's for, yeah. you know, if a kid's playing with yeah. it, then, you know. You want to make sure you explain yeah, it. They you know. understand it, but. Yeah. Come on, give me a way out. Yeah. Um, yeah, because I spent, like, Five minutes later on, just kind of get through a conversation. I wasn't even reading it. I was yeah. just like, I just, I don't care. I just want to look yeah. at this one. I was trying to play with the house thing. I yeah. Think. 
and it was getting in my way. Yeah. Um, also, uh, they need a way to lock the buttons. Mm-hmm. So when you're putting it into the houses yeah. or the controls, it's not just mashing buttons. Yeah. <laughs> so they need like a little lock button, put it in, unlock. Yeah. Simple as that. Mm-hmm. Um, it could just be on the screen. Yeah. They add because that's kind of a problem. Yeah. It's um, kind of weird, yeah. You, you end up like you're you're, you're going to mash like especially the trigger buttons. Yeah, you're going to mash them, sliding them in. Yeah, and it's like okay, well, they should have made a way to to lock those. Yeah, because uh, you'll end up on something else. Yeah, pretty quick. Yeah, uh, that's true. Which I think is how I ended up in the dialogue is because of that. Yeah, they was you mashing the button and, and then it was taking me through yeah. something else. I was like, no, I don't. <sighs> so it's a little frustrating. Yeah, um, but that aside. It's Re- pretty. It's really cool. It is pretty. I, I have. I still had their motorcycle one mm-hmm. to build. Mm-hmm. That's my next one. And then I had the piano one, which is the one I'm most excited for. Yeah. But I've been kind of like holding back mm-hmm. and not like burning through it, mostly because I, I just finding time to put them together. Yeah, like it takes, takes a while. It takes a while. It took me like an hour or two to put together all of the ones I've built so far. Each one, yeah. Yeah, like I took. Yeah, it took the first one took me half an hour. I think the second one took me an hour. I think the the house one took me an hour, almost an hour and a half, I think. Yeah. It takes a while. Yeah. Uh, it, like I said, I was mostly surprised by that. Uh, I think a lot of it I probably could have done it faster if I just kind of figured it out. Mm-hmm. But I'm trying to make sure I do it right and I'm following the instructions. And mm-hmm. yeah, Some of it's really basic, good. but... Yeah, you want to make sure you do yeah. it right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, yeah. It's, it's cool. Mm-hmm. It's really cool. Yeah, uh, I, I'm curious to see. Like I said, I want to play build the next two, and then it go into the more in depth stuff because it kind of gets more complex as it goes. Yeah, so it's kind of showing you how all these different pieces work, mm-hmm. and then I can see how it, once you get that settled and you get it, that under your belt, you can kind of play, start playing and figuring out more stuff to it. Yeah, and I'm curious how it, does the robot one just jump right into it because it, it's a big one. Mm-hmm. It's a big build. Yeah, uh, it is. Uh, I'm curious, like. And I'm wondering, can is do you have to buy? Is there a separate game? I haven't actually looked. I think it is. Okay, because I noticed when on yours it has a Labo and it has a one. Yeah. Where and and it says the t- the name of the set. Mm-hmm. Um, and I'm wondering. Uh, if so you I guess buy you the have other to buy one because it, it did occur to me that if it you had to buy the you know the variety the variety pack or the robot box and. Each one comes with a game, so I imagine they're separate games. Yeah. Because um, so. I didn't see anything for the robot on my copy of the game. Yeah, so. exactly. So, yeah. Mm. yeah. That's pretty pricey, by in. Yeah. I, I, I imagine the robot game is more of a robust, full on game, though. I would hope to so. A bunch of, like, I mean, the variety pack feels bucks. like a bunch of mini games. <laughs> yeah. While, like, that are all really cool and can yeah. get complicated. And it's still pricier than yeah. a regular game. Yeah, it was it's at 70. Uh, it was 70 bucks. And then you, the, you know, the robot is 80. Yeah. And I'm like, oh, yeah. that's one of the reasons. I mean, it makes sense because you're getting a lot of. Uh, a lot of cardboard. A lot of cardboard. It's cardboard. <laughs> yeah, but you know, you also get rubber bands and grommets and mm. and some stick reflective stickers mm. and yeah, bits, no, string no, 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 bits no, no, no. of string. Ridiculous. <laughs> Ridiculous. Uh huh. Um. But, oh well. Yeah. Um. Maybe. Maybe I'll buy the robot. Soon. You should. You should buy it the would robot. Be pretty fun, I think. Yeah. Um, we get paid tomorrow. You should buy the robot. Um, <laughs> I want to buy other things. <laughs> I know. I uh, and save money. Uh huh. Um, but yeah, mm-hmm. um, I haven't played any more of the uh, Zero or Horizon Zero Dawn. I just no. haven't got around. Yeah, to Yeah, I was gonna ask if you because you hadn't hadn't mentioned it in a while. No, I haven't. I haven't played any. It's I haven't played much at all this week. I just yeah. got home and I'm just like, meh, I'm tired. <sighs> so who cares about my listeners and wanting me to talk about games? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> whatever. Fuck those guys. <laughs> uh, I mean. No. We that love wrong, you. That is the wrong attitude, Dudley. <laughs> that is the wrong attitude. Oh. I'm going to ban you from this show. <laughs> Good luck. Uh-huh. Good luck. I'm, I I have the password to the to the hosting. Yeah, but I, not the hosting. Well, mm-hmm. to the... Mm-hmm. To the show. To Good the, luck. The, Good luck putting your new show on new, the internet. I can get it. I can do it. I'll do it. I'll mm-hmm. figure it out. Mm-hmm. I'll make it work. Mm-hmm. Uh huh. <laughs> it's like all of a sudden, Deaf and Dumb Two <laughs> is on iTunes. Deaf and Dumb, the real podcast. <laughs> uh huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. Good luck. Um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> Building also, your audience again. As if. Yeah. As if um, uh, it, it's not like we got, we're that far in. <laughs> uh, we're, we're two years in. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I don't, I haven't seen the numbers. Uh-huh. You never see your numbers. I, I never do. It's, mm-hmm. no, it's to save my ego. Mm-hmm. Um, mm-hmm. the, uh, 
as if I hadn't bought enough stuff in the last weekend or two. Mm-hmm. I bought another game yesterday. What? Yeah. What'd you buy? I bought oh, yeah. Minute. Yeah. yeah. It was just, How was that? It felt weird. It's M-I-N-I-T. Mm-hmm. It's fantastic. Yeah, it's really, it looks really good. Really cool. It's really cool. It's ten bucks on Steam. It's really, it's only ten bucks. It's only ten bucks. Mm, it uh, I'm came out. That. It uh, it came out uh, early last month. Yeah. Uh, it was a game that we saw at PAX. PAX, mm-hmm. and I I had it on my list of things to keep an eye out for, and it came out and I missed it. <laughs> yeah. But uh, the it's fantastic. Okay, so basically it's kind of like uh like. Super uh, like Super Nintendo, Link to the Past, mm-hmm. Zelda, Link to the Past yeah. style, top down, top down, two D, run around swinging a sword. Except a, it's in black and white, mm-hmm. uh, which is a cool aesthetic. And two, you have sixty seconds before you die. Yeah. So you basically you have sixty seconds to you. You start in your house, and you walk, and you have sixty seconds to go and do it, try to figure as much as you can, and then you die, and you go back to your house, and then you you don't lose progress on certain things that like like you know if you found a new item, you don't have to go get that item again, and you don't have to like once you've done something, you don't have to do it again. It's just it doesn't reset time. It's just you only your have position. Yeah, changes. you basically have sixty seconds to to get from your house to wherever you're trying to go and do your stuff, and it's cool. It's got a lot of little puzzles. It's got a little... And a lot of it's based on getting there, fast enough, and doing it before you run out of time. Yeah. Uh, and then, like, staring at it, trying to figure it out yeah. before you run out of time. Yeah. And, and you go, okay, of... I figured it out. Mm-hmm. Die, come back. And yeah, do it, exactly. And, do it, try it. And, and it's really clever because there's things that'll hang you up and make you, you know... You're like, oh, but there's people running around. They'll talk to you, and you stop, and you're reading it real quick. There's a character who's trying to tell you some important information, but he's old, mm. and he talks really slowly. <laughs> like, it's just like, hello. No, and it's no. just like slowly typing out. And in fact, the first time I, I couldn't get through all his dialogue. He wouldn't, he would, I would die before he finished talking, which is <laughs> hilarious. And then, well, honestly, it wasn't until way later that I was able to get there fast enough. And hear whatever the hell he had to tell me. Does he start over every time? He yeah, talks? like when you go up to him, he just starts talking again. He starts from the beginning. Like he says oh, the same no. thing. They all say the same thing every time you see him. Yeah. But um, and there's cool little puzzles, and you unlock different items that give you let you into new areas. And it's really cool. Yeah. I really like it. Hmm. So it's only ten bucks. Go grab it. It's awesome. Ten bucks is a good deal. Yes. Yes. It's a really good deal. It's I may fantastic. grab that. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know it was that cheap. Right? Yeah. I might have grabbed it already. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I went ahead and get it. I was like, I can skip lunch and eat and buy that game. Exactly. It's 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 just skip a lunch. I, buy. I I equate everything based on how many lunches do I have to skip. Yeah. To have this, this game is worth six lunches. Mm-hmm. I'll have to skip six lunches to have this. <laughs> uh, that's, that sounds really sad. <laughs> Man, I could money. starve for a week and I could buy this. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, you know, something that you sacrifice. <laughs> you have to make sacrifices uh-huh. for the things you love. Uh-huh. And. Uh, uh, sometimes it's hard, you know. Sometimes you gotta you gotta mm-hmm. get rid of something else you love, like food, <laughs> to have something else uh-huh. that you might okay. love just as much. Yeah, if not more. Yeah, like video games uh-huh. and destiny cards. Mm-hmm. But and and by the my scale of uh, money to time yes. ratio, it's well worth the money. Oh yeah, yeah I mean yeah, I've definitely. already spent more than uh, uh, ten minutes in the game. Yeah. That's well, not right. That's not right at all. <laughs> ten hours. I mean, ten hours. Ten hours. I have not spent more than ten hours, but I'm coming close. I was going to say, you got to spend ten hours for the dollars. I did ten minutes. Hour. I don't know why. Not quite. Let's see. I'm probably getting So close. you've only died ten times? No. <laughs> well, yeah. Yeah. No, no. That's that's not right. Uh-huh. I don't know what I said ten minutes for. Okay. I'm an idiot. You you don't even know your own system. I do know my own system. I just, for some reason, it's, said the wrong it's thing. It's dollar to hour. <laughs> Yeah, I probably like. I'm, I'm trying to think how long I've played it. It's hard to tell because I do everything in sixty seconds. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so do you feel like it changed your life? Now everything is a sixty second thing. It's like I have yeah, to get like, to the. I have to get to the kitchen no way and get, get some water show. and get back to my r- and get out back over here before <laughs> sixty se- uh, seconds. Yeah, it? it's basically run over here, do this, run over here, and get. Uh, so in sixty if, seconds, you, you have to restart to the podcast, show. Like. <laughs> Every 60 seconds, one of us dies, and I, we run over from the house. We yeah. just have to stagger it. So yeah. That, yeah. For 30 seconds, you're there talking. It would be a really annoying show. It would you be. just be like, hello! Also, like, when you die, it makes a noise, and you hear laughing. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So just, like, every 60 seconds, ha, 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 ha. 
Hello and welcome. Hello. <laughs> and I'm back. And we're back. We wouldn't do the introduction every time. We would just we pick are. up where we try to pick up where we are. Yeah, so With there'd be like a 60, 60 second, second dead air. Yeah. Well, not necessarily. If we stagger it right, you know, you talk. One of us would be here. Yeah. The other one would yeah, the, you, you're talking for 30 minutes and then I show up, uh-huh. pick up for 30 minutes. We have an overlap and then you die. 30 seconds. 30, I said 30 seconds. You said 30 minutes. Whatever. I'm not good with time. Uh huh. You're terrible minutes, with it. Minutes, hours. Time. What's the difference? Uh, well, it's a big deal in minutes. <laughs> Um. Uh, okay. Did yeah. you play anything else? Um. I. I that's d- pretty much it. I yeah. believe. I. I looked at a couple other things, but yeah. that's mostly. It. I'm gonna be playing all of those yeah. a lot more. That's uh, good. That's I'm good. gonna build the next two labos. I may build the next one more today. Uh, depending on time. Mm-hmm. And uh, but I definitely want to play. If you have a I minute. <laughs> a minute. Yes. But I also find myself just going back to minute mm-hmm. because it just it, it just takes so little time. I mean, that's <laughs> not entirely true, but mm-hmm. it's it draws you in. Mm-hmm. And, like, I keep buying... It's cool because there's, you know, you keep progressing. Like, mm-hmm. you keep, like, okay, now, now I need to go explore this area now. And I'm exploring this area as fast as I can. And it gives a sense of urgency. So you're, like, constantly hurrying. and like, okay, I'm going to run over here and see what's over here. Uh, I up that night. And then, you know, I'm running back over there. I, I know which way to go now, and I go this way. Mm-hmm. And, or, like, I almost figured this puzzle out, and I died, and I go back, and I finish it. Yeah. And, or, and it's like, well, I can't quite get there because for some reason I can't cross this area, or there's some well, it's, there's it's an like... object blocking my way. I don't know how to get past yet. And then I go, and, I, oh, I found the object that lets me get past this, and now I'm, I've am i unlocked a whole new it's area. It's like you're I'm doing a to. constant speed run of a game. Kind of. Um, there are kind of a, There is a type of checkpoint mm. in them that I won't explain, but you you should go check the game out and play it. It's really cool. Check out the checkpoint. Check out the checkpoint. But okay. uh, it's really cool. Really quick. Really, like I said, it's cheap and awesome. Mm. Okay. It's easily worth the money. All right. Then. Yeah. Got I the like endorsement. Got the endorsement. Mm-hmm. Go get it. All right. Yeah. Mo- shall we go on to news? Uh, sure, sure, sure. I don't have a lot. Okay. So we're going to take savor these. <laughs> we're going to um, just savor these news I more I found so. out something about Stardew Valley that I did not know. What's that? Uh, Stardew Valley has a multiplayer coming. It just came, yeah. yeah There's the betas, the betas out, out for the PC ones. Yes. But I did not know this was yes. a thing. Yeah. Why did I, you not I, tell me? I heard about it, but I just, you know, I knew it was It seems like something we should talk about. Well, we're talking about it now, aren't well, we? Well, isn't that, isn't that good I should have known right? sooner. Well, you know, it, it wasn't pertinent. Yes, it was. It, it was, was announced, like, in November yeah, last year. Yeah, but... but it was we knew it wasn't coming yet, so oh. we just we wait until it's you know relevant. We yeah. don't want to jump on this and be like, oh yes, oh, Red Dead we've been talking about two trailers are out, but it's not out till October, so we're not talking about. No, it. we're talking about that next. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so uh, Stardew Valley uh, yes. multiplayer yes. allows you to have like up to three other people come into. Oh your wow, room. is that many? Yeah, I didn't know that. It's yeah. like do you wonderful. all work the same land? Yeah, and you just live. Well, together? what it is is it's like it's kind of like the what Minecraft. It is, is. What it is. I don't know why that statement. You say it a lot. What but it I don't is? know why it always amuses me. What I, it I, is? It's something about what it is is. <laughs> that, what it is? Yeah. Is <laughs> exactly. I don't know why that. It's, it's a valid a weird, sentence. It's a weird sentence, and it mu- it makes me giggle every uh, time you say it. I don't know why. <laughs> you want me to flip it? Is it was <laughs> is. <laughs> so the ises aren't next to each other. What it is? What it is is. Uh huh. The uh, it's like the Minecraft co-op multiplayer. How about here's what it is? No. No. I don't no. Know. What it is is. <laughs> uh, <laughs> the. You made me lose my train of thought. <laughs> uh, Minecraft. Yes. You know, it's a thing where you, you know, you switch to land mode and then people can cop into your game. It's the same way. Okay. So you can build cabins on your land. Okay. And the number of cabins, the number of people you can have in oh, your Oh, so you have to, like, game. actually spend resource, yeah. in-game resources. It's not a lot, apparently. It's yeah. really, really cheap to yeah. build, to do a house, like, and uh, it only takes a day to build them. Okay. Um, so the... So, so are these like siblings, or are they like you know they also inherited land? Are they cousins coming I have no for the idea. weekend? I don't know what the or theme is. It open for, for <laughs> interpretation, or is it just like you know? Uh, because slaves, you can, you, you can build, you marry build each other. You can marry your friends. That's cool, but if they're not always there, 
Yeah, they're on vacation. Okay. They are they're on sabbatical. Where's mommy? She mm. went on vacation. <laughs> Never a to long return time. again. You imagine playing she this went with on your, vacation. Like, your She's girlfriend been gone for three years. At playing uh, it. That, that's oh, not I didn't the point. think about that. What? Uh, my girlfriend wants to get into new games. Yeah. And if they come out with this, uh, maybe we can. Then they add it to the Switch version. Yeah. Then uh, you know I could get her could get her to play it, and we could play in yeah, the same game. You have game. to get her a Switch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but she talked interest in uh-huh. it, but she, she hasn't she, yeah committed anything yet. Okay. Um, but uh, uh-huh. anyway, but this feels a lot like you you built a house and you make people live there and do work on your land. No, they can do whatever they want. They uh, can interact with other NPCs. They can I marry want... NPCs in your game, and oh, if they do that, you oh, can't drama. Uh, drama. Yeah, you could like start hitting up the other character's wife. <laughs> well, because there is divorce in the game. Yeah, I guess so. I don't know, but it. Right. Oh, this is gonna be awesome! This just got way more cool. Um, but yeah, I'm come I mean, steal your but wife. you can all work together to the goal. I'm gonna and, come and steal your wife, Dudley. Um, it might be pretty good. I'm gonna come steal uh, your we wife. We may have to make second save files to uh, <laughs> to uh, uh-huh. to uh, play together. Uh-huh. I'm gonna um, steal your wife. Okay. Um, but yeah, it looks good. It looks interesting. Mm-hmm. And you're over there doing something. I don't know. Yeah, and you're yeah. not responding. Yeah, no, and cool. engaging in conversation. It is cool. Uh, it mean, sounds pretty good, mm-hmm. um, and I it just brings a whole other layer to the game that I never uh-huh. thought about. Yeah. Um, but yeah. uh, I don't know if you, I, if you share, have a joint monies or all that, but I assume only if you marry. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, maybe, maybe. maybe I don't know. I mean, certain things you have to do together, uh-huh. like um, you know, events. You know, yeah. festivals, you have to all everyone you know, go to it at the same time yeah. or else it won't start. Yeah, exactly. Stuff because like it, that. it jumps time forward, and so yeah. you have to. Mm-hmm. Uh, I, I'm kind of curious how it's like if you marry them, uh, do you suddenly have a joint bank account? And then <laughs> you... I don't know. I don't know. Mm-hmm. We have to get and some... then, well, technically you'll live in the house with them, right? Or I do guess. You still, do you marry them and you still live in the shack that I built out in my backyard? I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> we'll have to, you know, uh, explore. I'm curious. To, like, to, is it like Minecraft where everyone has to go to bed? To... Yes. Okay. Everyone has to go to bed at the same time. Uh, stuff like that. Okay. So you have to uh, kind of coordinate a little bit. And like, okay, I'm gonna be an asshole and just stay up. And make like, I'm gonna tired. stay up all night. Make you all all tired tomorrow. Uh-huh. <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah. That's uh, that's a thing. Uh-huh. So. It, it's interesting. I am intrigued. I'm intrigued as well. I'm hope mm. hopefully it'll come out with the, for the Switch soon. I don't. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't uh, know. It's still in early early. It's testing. in beta right now it's in on beta, PC, not, but PC I think it's supposed to come out on yeah. Switch later. See, I um, own it on PC, but I don't know if I only know anyone else who owns it. Yeah, that's true. You gotta have friends. You gotta have friends with um, the same games. I have friends, just not all of them have the same game. Mm-hmm. Um. Red Dead Redemption 2. Red Dead Redemption 2. Put out a new trailer. Mm-hmm. Yes, it did. And it looks glorious. It looks fantastic. It looks I mean, great. we already knew this, but it now we know for sure. really good. It looks real good. We have a little more details on uh-huh. the, who you're playing. Uh-huh. Uh, yeah. The, some of the character dynamics yeah. in the game. Some of the mm-hmm. gameplay mm-hmm. information is coming yeah, out. Yeah, IGN had some exclusive articles. Yeah, and it about. sounds... They got to play a demo of it. And uh-huh. Oh, it sounds cool. It sounds really. Sounds like good. there's kind of a community building. It looks like there's like a ma- uh, yeah a a managing system where you're kind of take you're care, care of this of the camp, gang. Uh, the, the gang, gang that you're part of, and yeah, um, you whether you do or not, then it'll evolve based mm-hmm. on what you uh, yeah. what you do. Yeah. Um, and if you support it or not, and how angry they will be with you <laughs> if you don't. And yeah. uh, it sounds good. It looks really good. Um, th- I've also some interesting things about like cinematics in mm-hmm. it, and oh, yeah. how you know yeah. it. It doesn't necessarily like if you talk to somebody, it doesn't go into a little. Okay, you're now talking to this person. Yeah, like it, if you, you well, know, in GTA Five and in uh, the last, the first Red Dead, if you you go into like a little triggered event where you yeah. it triggers the cinematic and you go yeah. into a cut apparently scene. there's a little bit more of a gray area yeah. as to when those happen because you you don't it's more really fluid. it's more fluid, more natural, mm-hmm. um, where you're just like. If you're walking by and a guy calls out something, you can you can like stop to and interact it. with him. But you don't have you could keep walking and, then, and like whatever care. you don't yeah. have to engage. Yeah. And so they're kind of 
they from the rock star they're they're trying to you know avoid you know blur blur the edges of mm-hmm. where like side quests are and mm-hmm. main quests and yeah. all that. It's more of uh, what your character's doing at yeah. that time, and mm-hmm. and it sounds really good. Yeah, I also I think we learned that uh, that you're not playing multiple characters this time. At least that's which, the, from the demos. They yeah, said you're only playing demo, one character. Yeah, so one character like as opposed you to play three. One car- yeah, mm-hmm. we there, we were all wondering because the, with Grand Theft Auto Five you had three characters, mm-hmm. and everyone was wondering this had seven characters. Mm-hmm. Are you playing all of them? Because that would be insane. Yeah. And then I was kind of worried at first. I was excited by it, but then I kind of the more I thought about, it, the more I was worried about it because it seemed like you would get less out of each yeah each car- segment yeah. and then also like I, I the way red dead is it's the to how the story is focused in red dead to, the first red dead mm-hmm. it's more i felt that it was more emotional and mm-hmm. more like you know yeah than you know grand theft auto which yeah is, has it's always just been running more down. about running out cra- doing crazy stuff than necessarily yeah. which they did they incorporated in with one of the characters and yeah GTA and that's kind of why i think they did that in yeah. grand theft auto 5 is that you yeah, have one the, character the more you just i think about it i think it's with. better to just stick with just one character and, yeah. and have the whole story focused around them and i i, I kind of like that idea better yeah. i think it fits with the red dead theme better yeah but oh it, man uh, i can't wait I, uh, I i'm not i'm really excited about the game I'm not also. I'm not really excited about the prospect of having to purchase a console mm-hmm. so you can so that I can, can play, play it sooner. because it's not coming out on PC yet. Mm-hmm. Because Rockstar does that, and I don't like it. <laughs> yeah, I'm excited because I have a PlayStation Four, and I'll be able to play it when mm-hmm. it comes out in October. I'm kind of hoping they come out with a bundle. That'd be nice. That'd be real nice. And um, then I could just get system. it all, all together. Uh, it just but depends on what system it bundles with. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, it probably needs. It would be, be like <gasps> we came out with a bundle on the X. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Xbox One, which would be a stupid purchase, because <laughs> there's no reason to own an Xbox One. Well, especially if you have a PC. If you have a PC, and you have a nice or PC. Or just buy a PC. Yeah. Don't get an Xbox One. Well, it's cheaper to buy an Xbox. Depend on the PC. So, yeah, but... You could you, make a pretty uh, decent PC for the price of an Xbox yeah, One X, but or whatever the high-end one is. Yeah. Um... And it'd be solid. Mm-hmm. And then you can do other stuff on mm-hmm. it besides just play games. Yeah. So, yeah. And all those Xbox exclusives are also on PC. Yeah, so exactly. they're not very That's exclusive. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. Yeah. Um, I, uh, yeah. So, the, yeah. So, you're going to probably buy a PlayStation when it yeah, comes out? Yeah. Possibly. Been, probably eventually. Possibly. Um, that, yeah. mm-hmm. It's in my future. Mm-hmm. Unless they suddenly announce that, hey, it's coming out on PC at the same time. Well, as many delays that it had, it's always possible. <laughs> it is possible. It'd uh-huh. be cool. It'd be real nice. Mm-hmm. be real nice for me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But I wouldn't hold my breath. Well, you know, we'll see. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And, you know, I'll I end up... I still got out. time. It's not out to October. I'll probably end up owning two copies of it, because, uh, you I know, yeah, I'll when it comes out on PC, I'll mm-hmm. probably buy it on PC. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Because what I did with Grand Theft Auto, yeah. I played it on Xbox until it came out on PC, and yeah. then now I own it on PC, and I yeah. only play it on PC. Yeah. Um. But, yeah. Mm-hmm. But I I can't wait. I this, cannot wait. I'm also really awesome. excited about the because the online even when with the first one was a lot of fun on it. Uh-huh. And this one's I just imagine better. it's gonna be even better. Yeah. I can't wait. It's gonna be so cool. Mm-hmm. It's one of the it's one of the games I'm most looking forward to. Yeah, that's the only game I'm really looking forward yeah. to this year. And 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 I'm just like, oh, I can't mm-hmm. wait for this. It's gonna be so mm-hmm. fun. So much fun. It's gonna be it's good. Just, it's so good. Um, I w- came across an, an article just before we started recording this, yeah. and I so I only got the gist of it. Um, the CIA made a board game, actually a couple of board games. I saw something about this, and I I was like, I need to read into this, and then I forgot about it. <laughs> yeah, um, apparently they they some people have used the Freedom of Information Act to mm-hmm. gather information about these board games. Mm-hmm. Um. Um, and apparently they use them as a training tool. Okay. And I don't know much about them, but the prospect that the CIA made board games is it's like interesting. yeah, training tools like yeah, uh, scenario role playing. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I'm not 100 percent sure. I want to play whatever these CIA people are playing. Yeah. Um, is it code breaking? Is it? Well, it could be anything. It 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 it's a uh, it's. It's one of them's called Collection de- Deck. Okay. Um, but I, I, I like I said, it's just came out across it, like gathering information. And I think it's it's gla- gather about gathering information. I think that's what the whole thing. Is. But mm-hmm. they've uh, a couple of people have made 
copy very versions of the game. Okay. Um. So. It, so that it because it, it, it's you know it's, out, it's there. out there and you know they just took the uh, the the information and made and made it. So mm-hmm. I don't know. It's something we might want to look into. It might be. Yeah, uh, it might be fun. See what the TIA is see, playing. Yeah. See what the. <laughs> See what the uh, uh-huh. CIA is doing with yeah. their uh, with all our money. Uh-huh. Not all our money, but a percentage of our money. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, a percentage of a percentage of our money. Mm-hmm. Yes. Uh, <laughs> yes. You got anything else? That's basically all I have. Uh-huh. What? Well, uh, uh, yeah. Okay. I I just want to go back and play either minute or build something in out of cardboard. Yeah. I'm just going to build stuff out of cardboard now. That's good. That's good. Yeah. You should do that. I Yeah. Yeah. It's some complicated cardboard stuff going yeah. on there. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hopefully. Oh, and there's a couple other things I, I forgot. Hopefully we'll be doing another draft this week. <laughs> That'd be nice. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, for Star Wars <laughs> Destiny with, with Gary and, and the guys. Yes. Yes. We should. Um, so maybe we'll have another game. But yes. also we're very close to our diplomacy online. Yes. Yes, we are. We have we, six we have people. Almost, yeah, almost all the players. We have I'm six sorry, people. I got a tickle in my throat. <laughs> Stop it! You just <laughs> die on your own time. Sorry. Uh, and we were almost done. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you just had to start coughing and yeah. ruining the quality of our show. Uh huh. Sure. And it's always you. Uh-huh. <laughs> uh huh. Mister. Yeah. Yanni. So we need. We're still. We're, we need one more person, and, yeah, and hopefully we can I convince them. I think we them. have it. I think and then we'll, we'll be able to start a uh, yeah. a game, and we'll so, be uh, p- probably updating weekly um, on that. Yeah, because the turns are a week long, mm-hmm. and so it gives everyone plenty of time to you know work around with their schedules mm-hmm. to play. Yeah. And uh, it should be fun. Yeah, should I'm looking fun. forward to. I'm it. already excited. Should, I should be I, good. I I was talking to Trey about it because mm-hmm. he's one of the guys in on it. He hasn't looked at it, so he didn't know all the stuff yeah. that's involved. And yeah. I was telling him yeah the st- about the press releases. Yes. and. and it's, it's got a lot of cool stuff going. It's gonna be good. Yes, it's gonna be really good. It's gonna be really good. Yeah. Um. Hopefully, no one will be grudgy and angry at us. Uh, that's that's probably a lofty goal. <laughs> <laughs> we'll hopefully still have six friends by the end of it. Well, or, I mean, most of them have played with us before, mm-hmm. but they know. They know what they're getting. Mm-hmm. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh. Well. Thank right. you for uh, listening to us. Uh, please go to our website at deafanddumb.com. That's D-E-A-F-N-D-U-M-B.com. And uh, we put out a new episode every Monday, as I'm sure you've already noticed. Mm-hmm. Uh, one, we've been going strong for, I don't know how many, 100 and whatever 16 it is. 16 episodes. 116 weeks. Mm-hmm. And we're going to keep doing it until we're dead. Probably. Or the world blows up. Whichever happens. Or one Which, of us is dead. Uh, well, I mean, that doesn't necessarily mean we have to stop. I mean, I'm going to rebrand it if you're dead. <laughs> oh, I'm going to just keep rolling like nothing changed. Okay. Uh, <laughs> they will, they will, it'll be a 30-minute episode uh-huh. where you just talk about what games you play. Yeah, And exactly. there'll be no news. Because I actually played games. <laughs> and there'll be no news at all. <laughs> That's basically what no, will happen. No, I'll bring someone else in on the news. <laughs> Uh, yeah, whatever. You get five minutes. <laughs> yeah, go for it. I'm going to talk about games. I'll audition different people, see who works better. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, Good luck with that. But yeah, if you go to our website, you can subscribe to us. You can follow us on uh, social medias. Please do. And uh, please rate us on iTunes or Stitcher or wherever you are listening to us. It makes us look good. It makes us feel good. And uh, we're just keep putting out episodes. Mm-hmm. And uh, thank you very much for listening. I'm Dan May. And I'm Dudley May. And this has been Deaf and Dumb. <laughs>